Well, good afternoon, Northern Michigan, from your National Weather Service right here in Gaylord. Welcome to the latest hazardous weather briefing for both Northern and Lower and East Upper Michigan. Today is Sunday, the 15th of September, 2013. Taking a look at upcoming hazards, we're increasingly concerned about frost and isolated freezing conditions, mainly across the interior sections of Northern and Lower Michigan, and that'll be Monday night and early Tuesday, and of course that will cause damage to sensitive vegetation. In addition, we're looking at uh, the redevelopment of at least some isolated to scattered thunderstorms across much of northern Michigan, and that'll be Wednesday night through Friday, and much too early to get specific on any intensity issues with those thunderstorms. Take a look at the current weather map. You can see a cold front dropping south through the northern lakes with an area of low pressure back across Iowa. Now the moisture between these two systems is kicking off an area of some light rain showers, locally lake enhanced along Lake Michigan, and that will continue to slide southeast through the overnight, basically clearing the area just after midnight. Now there could be some lingering drizzle and very light showers up in the higher terrain this evening and off of Lake Huron across northeast lower Michigan. Otherwise, skies will clear from north to south overnight with the rather cool conditions across eastern upper Michigan where areas may dip down into the middle 30s. And then the next chance of rain arrives towards the middle of the end portions of the week. You can see low pressure here over southern Canada with a much stronger cold front dropping through the northern plains and a warm front stretching across the western Great Lakes. Now the combination of these frontal systems with that low pressure will bring at least periodic chances of rain beginning Wednesday lasting right through the beginning of the upcoming weekend. Taking a look at our weather graphic tonight, rain will end quickly this evening from north to south with skies clearing from north to south overnight. A touch chilly in eastern upper, middle 30s, and much warmer as we get towards the more persistent cloud cover with only 50 degrees in east Tawas and then widespread 40s in between. Recapping those hazards, primary concern is frost and isolated freezing conditions on Monday night. Once again, mainly across interior sections of northern and lower Michigan with the traditional colder locations such as Grayling and Atlanta area possibly dropping down into the upper 20s. And then thunderstorms are at least possible Wednesday night right through Friday across all of northern Michigan. Now this concludes the hazardous weather briefing for this afternoon. Thanks again for taking the time to listen. Your next update is expected around 5 a.m. tomorrow morning.